Hi, today I'm going to show you how to shelve books. Now when shelving fiction books, they go by the surname of the author. So for instance, this one on the shelf is by Kate Atkinson. We can see that from the front, so ATK, we go by the first three letters of the surname. And when you look on the spine, down the bottom it has F for fiction and ATK, which is the, author, the first three letters of the author's surname. And as you can see, we start from the A's and we go alphabetically. So when shelving, the best thing for you to do when you've got a pile of books first is to make sure that they're in alphabetical order. So the S, I would generally put on top. So the first one we've got is B-L-U, then we've got a D-O-R, an N-E-G and an S-I-N. And this makes it easier when you're shelving, so you're not going here, then there, then back here again, so that you can just start at the start and go through. So the first one we have is a B-L-U, so we look for the B's, the B's start here, B-A-G, not, not even nearly close. Keep going, keep going, B-L-A, so we know it's after B-L-A. Next one we see is a B-O-O, -O. it's definitely before that, so it must be in between. This is a B-L-U as well, a Judy Bloom, this is exactly the same, so we shelve it in there. Then we move on to the second book, which is by Pamela Dorr, D-O-R. I didn't even need to really look at that because it's always stated on the cutter. So D-O-R. And then what I do is I need to look along the shelf. C's, D-D-O-B, D-O-N, D-O-U. And we know that R is before U and after N. So it just slips in there. And that's how you shelf and you just keep doing it that way.